Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today, as you can all see from the title, I'm gonna be doing a review on Sublime Slime. I hope I said that right, but I pretty much ordered a slime from them off of Etsy and I'm going to be reviewing it for you guys. I also ordered some more slimes and I'm gonna be doing a review on those, but I literally just got this in the mail like five minutes ago and it's also pretty late at night, but I decided to still film this. So I hope you all enjoy and let's get started. I haven't even looked at it yet. I just opened it up and I got a lavender three ounce slime. This was on sale for only $5 and it's usually $7, which is still kind of pricey. But let's just see. All right, let's see, okay. So we got a few things. First up, we have a slime instructions, which I don't really need that since I already know how to fix slime and stuff. Then we have the receipt. And then we also come with this little baggie with some fun goodies. So this has borax in it or activate powder and also that's their instagram if you want to check them out then we have a little sour patch kids gummy and then this is just a little thank you card if you would like to get any of their slimes that's all their information that you can get stuff so now to the point that we have all been waiting for is the review of this slime it's packaged very very nice so this is actually bigger than i thought the name of it is called lavender field and just said sub lime slimes so let's just open this up okay so first off i can definitely smell the lavender it smells super nice we have some purple slime and some white slime and like in the middle a little bit of blue slime with a lot of glitter on top so i think this was a butter slime wow that actually feels so nice it is a little sticky which is completely fine but she also said in the letter that temperatures are rising and with shipping and stuff so the slime might be a little sticky and it's already completely mixed up. I can definitely smell like glue and shaving cream. And it's honestly, I can't really smell the lavender anymore. I only smell shaving cream. So far, the texture is pretty nice. And yeah, I don't smell the lavender at all anymore. I only smell shaving cream. It is very stretchy, which is nice. Let's test out the butterness. That's not even a word, but we're just gonna pretend it is. So it is pretty spreadable, which is nice. Here are my final thoughts on this slime. At first, when I opened it, I definitely smelled lavender. Now, I only smell shaving cream. I don't know if that's just me, but I only smell shaving cream. Next on stretchiness, I would give it a solid eight out of 10. Pretty stretchy. After that is butterness. I would give that a 10 out of 10, pretty buttery. Nice slime. Color and you know how it looks. I would give that also a you know eight out of ten it looks really nice i love the color and packaging and how everything came i would also give that a 10 out of 10. it only took like three days to come about three days or so it came just about when it said that it would and it was super good Coming out of the package, it's definitely not a scam slime, but it's not exactly how it looked on the photo, at least for me, but that could be because I ordered a smaller size. I would probably order from them again, maybe if the prices weren't too high, but other than that, I really do like this slime and it's pretty amazing. I spent $5.04 
on this slime and with shipping, which obviously ranges wherever you live. I spent $4.95 on that, making my whole purchase $9.99. Two plus two is four, minus one, that's free, quick max. So about $10 for this one slime. And I got it on sale for $2.16 off. Yeah, guys, that is it for this review. I hope you all enjoyed. Bye.